Hi there everyone, Shauna Randolph here, spokesperson of the Edmonton Humane Society with your This Week at the EHS for February the 15th. And this week we focus on a headline making puppy and at the same time remind people that every animal that comes through our doors has its own story. Many of you have heard of Charleston, also known as Charles the pickup truck pup. He was in the news back in November of 2012 after Edmonton police removed him from a pickup truck allegedly abandoned inside without proper food, water and clean conditions. Charles went into the City of Edmonton's Animal Care and Control Centre until January when he was transferred to us. Since the pup was not in a home-like environment for several weeks and therefore not exposed to essential socialization that puppies require, Charleston went into foster care to spend about three weeks with one of our behaviour specialists to learn how to be a well-behaved puppy. He was in that foster home until he was ready to be placed up for adoption. So what did you do with him? He went into your home, you were fostering him. A lot of him learning to relax. So now you see him laying here, which is great. He did not know how to relax. He was leaping at the face with his mouth. He was grabbing your arms with his mouth. So he needed to learn basic sits and calming down. Charleston, good boy. It didn't take long for him to find his forever home, his fresh new start. He was adopted the day after being made available by a man named Bill, who had been looking for a dog for quite a while, his perfect fit. I've always wanted a dog and he just kind of stood out to me from the moment I saw him there. And after he had found out that he wasn't being put up for adoption right away, we had looked at a couple other dogs and quite a few other dogs actually. We ended up taking a cat from the Humane Society instead. As soon as my girlfriend noticed that he was up for adoption on Monday there, uh, she let me know right away and it just kind of, I knew he was the dog. Bill is well aware that since Charleston didn't have the optimum socialization start necessary for puppies from the very beginning, his training needs to continue and Bill will be registering Charleston into the next level of puppy training necessary here at the shelter. The story gives us an opportunity to remind people that there are so many other animals that come into our care with their own story and it's important for people to not get caught up in the hero mentality when a pet is featured in the news. Instead, to make sure an animal a person brings home is the perfect fit for their lifestyle and personality, like with Bill. So if you're looking for a pet with patience, you will find the one that is the perfect fit for you, just like Bill did, regardless of headlines. Just check our website. It is updated four times a day and then come down and fall in love. And by the way, we have about 30 or so other dogs available. That's your week in review. Join us again next Friday.